What is the number one thing a company can hope to get out of a 15-minute first meeting with you at a show like this? If companies present their value add in the beginning, we can discuss how we can bring them on future opportunities. Can you give me an example of a really great fit when a company had come to you and a small business made a big difference? I met a company a year ago at the Osibu conference that's now one of our strategic partners. They understood L3's customer environment, where we go to market, and our vision. This company now supports three of our contracts. What do you count at the end of the day? We measure our success based on the requirements that we can fill for current contracts. L3 is participating as a prime in a way that a lot of smaller businesses do. That's correct. We're out on the show floor. We're looking for small businesses that can help meet some of the opportunities that L3 is chasing. What kind of thing is it that means that they've set themselves apart and you really want to talk to them? They really have great marketing material already. We don't have to ask a whole lot of questions. We can see from their capability statement that they have their customers, they have their past performance, their NAICS codes. It's just a good way to talk and to meet and figure out who's out there. We believe the small businesses take a a lot of time to exhibit at the show. So we want to make sure that each small business has fair and equitable market, marketable opportunity to work with L3. We met with our capture management team to figure out what opportunities are out there prior to attending this conference so we know what's on their hot list. So you come with the hot list? We come with the hot list. We even network with a lot of our government customers. Mm -hmm. We are invited to do several small business shows with our government customers mm -hmm. just by being here today. Tell me about a couple of the small businesses that really caught your attention at the Osdebu conference and why. There were a few small businesses that actually had their awards from government agencies on their table. So it made it very attractive to us to go over there and figure out what agencies they were because if the agencies recognized them as valuable then we probably should as well. What are the next steps that you're going to take to follow up with the ones that are really high on your list? Well, we already took those steps and have meetings set up for the first and second week in May with the ones that we deem strategic for our program. So we took a proactive approach and then for the other companies we hope that they will contact us as teaming opportunities come about. What did you like about what you did and you're going to be sure to do again as a company next year? The panel participation. The panel participation tells us two things. What our other large businesses are doing for small business and second, the companies that are a strategic fit, they come to us after the event saying, hey, I know you guys are in this area, so are we. So it's kind of e easy one-on-one -on -one matchmaking after the um, panel discussion. We'll have full participation next year in the booths, the panels, and walking the floor. So it's very strategic for a small business to have a booth at the Asabu conference.